and welcome back to Alice the Madness Returns. I am mid-combat, because I guess that's where my save actually left me. Um, I've been meaning to, to get back to this a little while. Um, a lot of you were just like, yeah, this game's super sick, and the only thing I think people were letting me know is, by the way, my name's Matthew, and uh, <laughs> playing Alice today. Um, the only thing about it was that people were like, yeah, the combat never gets super much more in-depth than what's happening here. And I get that. I think I think in general people are saying the game's a bit too long. Like it just keeps sort of spinning its wheels. Not the worst thing in the world. Um, certainly a shame if that's really the case. I wonder if slowly over the course of years will I <laughs> come back to this every so often. So I'm next combat scenario. I'll, I'll press in the left stick to enter hysteria, which I am. I don't think I saw before. No, I think I did. Doesn't it all turn black and white and shit? I'm um, gonna need the pepper spray, the pepper grinder. Um, yeah, um, and and a lot of people let me know that like, uh, what what is it that the um, the uh, American McGee's like has a Kickstarter or did have a Kickstarter for a Alice spiritual successor? I don't think is Alice in Wonderland public domain. I, I tend not to think so, but I might be wrong. I've been wrong about many things, so <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. I think when we last... I think when we last played, our, our, our general mission was uh, just get to the Mad Hatter, I believe. Was I this far away from the Mad Hatter? No. Bad dream. This might not be him. I don't know. He doesn't wear a hat. A blasted good night. Hatter, I recall leaving you in a decrepit oh. condition. Oh. It is. And here, you've lost your hat, and some parts are missing. Missing indeed, though things be We're gonna have to Humpty Dumpty him, aren't we? Now what's going on? Ah, what's going on? Around and up and down, into my ears, into my eyes, not my nostrils, down my gullet, and whining in my caps. Papa was exceedingly fond of trains. I don't like them much. You won't like this one at all. Nothing like when Mock Turtle was in charge of the looking last line. This railroad's a bloody shambles. Yeah, I can smell the stink. I can see it. I get the idea. A bad train. The world is upside down, Alice. Inmates run the asylum. No thanks. And worst of all, I'm left. Of course, you're British. Tragic. If I do help, will you help me in return? Alice seems more like a coffee girl in this game. And toss them into the shoot. Machines will do the rest. Be on your way now. That's a good girl. Okay, so we're not gonna fight him, I guess. Maybe when we put him together, we're gonna have to. It's always gonna be, even though this is like my first time being this far into the game, and this is this is the first time I've seen this cutscene. I'm assuming every boss, every character type is gonna be some twisted, weird version. Because, I mean, look at we're playing. We're playing as a gothic Lolita, Alice in Wonderland. It's gonna make sense. So I do want to talk about this a bit more. I, like, combat systems are weird things. Sometimes, if you feel good enough, and there's enough, like, great feedback when you hit things and effects, I don't mind if it stays in a repetitive nature. Um, there are some exceptions, though. I might have talked about this last time, I might not, but guess what? You're listening to it again. Um, uh, Shadow Warrior 1, the rebooted Shadow Warrior 1. Uh, from a few years ago, from Flying Wild Hog, that game's combat got really repetitive at the end because they, they didn't have enough stuff to upgrade and, and do whatever. Like, I got everything I ever wanted, and there was, like, hours left in that game. So if that's it's good, that's going to be this bad in this game, like, eh, yeah, that's not going to be great. Hopefully that's not the case. Um, I guess I'll just head back. I don't think I have the ordinance for, for this unless the pepper spray does it. Yeah, I would I wouldn't doubt it. It did say in a loading screen to have weak walls. But I'm gonna assume we can't not do this. Oh wait! I forgot we had little bombs and shit. There you go. Wow, I almost did people in the comments are ready to give it to me. You have fucking bombs! Rabbit bombs, idiot! I'm like, I, 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 I didn't realize. I forgot. It's been a while. It's been months since I played this. What the fuck is that? I didn't know that the ultramarines were here. That's sick. Ultramarines cross smash 40k. Imagine. You know, if the Ultramarines were in, were, were, were like in uh, Smash 4, 
They would only play for glory, not fun. Shoot down bolter fries. I know, I know. Those are very fast loading screen tips. That helped to nobody. Smelling and regurgitation. All of the things when you are eating British food. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's not true. I love fish and I love uh, fish and chips. Please, I love British people. It's totally fine. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got umbrella. Uh, block. Cool. L T and A. We'll we'll do that. Too sweet. If uh, tank rarely losses block can deflect uh, certain enemy attacks. Oh god, people are still gonna be mad at me about saying that. Let's not. Let's let's see what the menacing ruin is up to. These are our cool enemies. Got the time that the very last second probably. There you go. Wow, I guess this must be like almost a mid boss because this is a lot of damage to take just for like a tutorial. Thing. Oh crap. Oh, wow! Shit! There you go, okay. Well, that's interesting. That's another great mechanic. I'm never gonna hate on a parry. Uh, even if it's a projectile parry. But maybe that can be applied to, uh... Um... Melee attacks. Like, not just, like, hitting them back, but, I don't get Getting frame advantage? It's weird to talk about frame advantage in a game like this. I'm never a huge fan of like loudspeakers in games getting across like bits of story like from a bad guy or something. Uh, hello sir. Um, I will hit you with the pepper spray just cause you're there and we'll see, see what happens. Absolutely nothing happens. That's fine. I, I like that even. That shows some gumption on that guy's part. But yeah, you know like when there's like a villain and he's just got the same things repeating on like a loudspeaker, like TVs and like a game world and you have to... I think Time Shift when I played that was really, really going super hard. I don't know why. I don't know who demanded that, but like... Your villain has to be the most interesting villain in the world to keep that entertaining, to listen to that over and over again. Uh. Uh, nope. Oh, that's to be exact. Whoa! I <laughs> I can't see what's going on behind me. Do you kind of wish the camera was a little like when it's gonna be a big platform like this? You know, I, I prefer it when like a camera is um uh a bit higher up just to show exact like the full breadth of the battlefield. I want to say. Yeah, it's very slashy washy, and I totally get that. I really want to upgrade my Vorpal blade. Uh, but it's still really satisfying, and again, this is only, what, like, the third hour of this game? Um, I'm just saying how I really regret not playing this at the time. Like, I think I said in the last video that I rented it, uh, back when I was renting games through, like, a rental service. Um, like, not Blockbuster or anything, obviously, but, like, um, it sucks because, like, I was really kind of blown away from that early bit I played, and like, I'm just glad I'm able to jump back in this and it, everything still feels good. And it wasn't some fever, fever dream where I'm like, wait, was that good? I, I did, uh, am I mixing this up with the first Alice game, which I never, ever touched? And no, that's like a, uh, I doubt I can make this. Unless, like, the, I don't know if the, the lava actually, like, pushes me up due to the heat exhaust or whatever, but. I kind of don't want to die right there. Um, so I will play it safe. Hello, sir. I'm just going to pre-slash at you if you don't mind before you spawn. Always nice when an area will get a few guys, but not like, not like a million, just so you have a little bit of combat to do. That's that's pretty smart. Don't don't fill it up with the boss guy, not the boss guy, but like the, the exact same enemy configuration from before. That's not, that's not optimal. But just a few, eh, that spices things up. Now, I need a brain to get over there, apparently. I don't think I currently have one of those. So, this is a weird thing. I was playing this originally, the first video I did, I was playing it on a disc on my Xbox 360. Like, I had the hard disc. But I had forgotten I had um, installed this originally on my Xbox One. So, I know I didn't get far on that version. So, I think the save migrated from the cloud from my Xbox 360? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what happened. I started it up and I was like, yeah, this seems like my save. Maybe maybe it migrated it. I'm not sure. Oh, fuck. That's a lot, actually. All right, I'm assuming that's the cooldown metal thing. You know, you know thank you to the Cheshire Cat for letting me know that uh, water cold cools down metal. Oh my god, really? These jumps, though, man, I don't know. You just, like, the very, like, it's not, like, pixel perfect or anything, but...
but they, they demand a lot from you. All right, can't auto target him yet. I don't think you can actually hit me from there. I will say as he probably hits me from there. This is bad stuff. This is this is this is damage. Okay. Not exactly sure what why that is, but that's fine. Now I have to remember, can I level up whenever I want? I think I can't. I think it's in between levels. Let's see if we can do it. I'm trying to remember. Uh yeah, I want Yeah, I want to up. Okay, good. No, you don't have enough to even like doesn't even let you see the menu. I can do the pepper grinder though. I think. Um, give me some to upgrade your pepper grinder. Are you sure you like to upgrade? What does it do though? What is it? Does it damage? Ooh, up over there. Though. Oh shit! Oh oh oh! Hello! Did not know that these were sneaking in. I was too busy looking for the the pig stout. Butterflies or bolter? I don't know what what they were called. This name I don't like. Butterflies. This doesn't sound very pleasant. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna try to go for it. I don't care. I don't care at this point. I do care. I do care. I do care. Whoa! Ah! Oh! Oh! It's fine. It's fine. And I, I don't know about you guys, but like with certain with certain enemy design, where it's like they just attach to you or or hamper you in some way, and just you're just not allowed to do an action like. It's a gameplay contrivance for sure, and a very common one, but it's not one I, I'm like, oh yes, nice, an enemy that does this. Oh fuck, got him, okay, good, good. Please, flies, go away. Not a fan of them now. That really makes combat encounters a little bit more annoying than they need to be. I mean, I guess that's the point. They're fly-like insect enemies in a action platforming game. I get it, but eh. All right, I feel classic. Gotta go up the sort of uh, level design here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh? <laughs> what? What? Really? Really? The really? Uh, okay, if you say so. You're you're the game, I guess. <laughs> I just wish I could, because I'm holding A. I wish I could orientate myself. Flicking the control stick at the last second is probably not the best way to do it. Okay, I think I'm just like mistiming my double jumps, maybe. Do another one there, and then try it. Yeah. Oh, it's only worth one. Never mind. I, I, I think I think I'm seeing gold. It might just be the lighting and all te teeth. All teeths are the same. All teeths. Yes, math. The teeths. Uh, all tooths are the same. Monetary value. I guess get up there if I can. <laughs> really? Oh, Jesus, okay. I, I, I totally felt like that was gonna, gonna do it. Oh, that's why. I really couldn't see that platform because it's actually masked by the steam. That's why I kept, like, missing it. All right, this should work now. Here we go. Spin it all. Spin it all. Vorpal plate. I have it now. Just, yes. Upgrade. Either, yeah, yes, don't even ask, just do it. I don't know what it did. I guess it's just damage. Alright, I have literally, like, no teeth. <laughs> Lost all my teeth. Does it look different or so? Ooh, there's, there's a red streak on it now. That is something. I don't really want to talk to Cheshire, okay? He tells me stuff I know. I'll regret this later, for sure, don't get me wrong, but for now... I'm just gonna not pay attention to him. Oh, I forgot about these guys. I didn't even know that they're a thing. Like, yeah, what, what I'm thinking is that maybe my combo extends, but I don't think, like, I get... Like, you know, I can't launch guys, I assume. So it really doesn't. I can't block with that, huh, at all. Like, melee strikes. Wow, another one of these. Oh, this is the, that horrible mouse. Uh, dude, that's that's disgusting. And it's like it it's it's rat trap from Beast Wars, trans metals even. Okay, you're showing me some shit. A lot's going on. We we will we will give this a good try. Whatever I need to be doing right now doesn't do anything. Great. Okay. I cannot get there. I don't think yet. Maybe that I I loop back around that. No, no. This is this is this is true way, true path. 
Oh, oh, okay, okay. I that animation started before I jumped, so I sh I should have I should have waited. Okay, it's it sends you back. Oh, all right, all right. It's, it's a cooling down thing. Not fe not feeling that character too much. The, the delivery is a little off there, I kind of find, and the, the, the dialogue's not particularly clever, unlike most of the dialogue so far. But all this froze at inconvenient angles. Oh my god, are those stupid nests? Oh Jesus Christ. Oh, can I get can I get some shots in? I, I don't think I can jump and shoot, right? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think I'm, I'm making those shots, so I have to get I have to get a bit higher. This is an Alice in Wonderland game. It's all it's literally all it's about. Zounds! A minor hindrance, a trivial impediment. <laughs> I'll just move along. I'll deal with you later, Alice. You'll never stop our grand plan. Which is what, weirdos? Which is what? Wow, that's an extreme zoom in on Alice there. So people are saying why Alice is so like, you know, uh, doll-esque and pretty compared to like all the other um, human characters. It's because that's the way she sees herself and, or, or something like that. Like, I think it was just a theory, but I was like, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll, I'll bite that. I'll, I'll accept that. This game seems to be doing some things of that nature. That's some dark crystal shit up there. Don't even get me started. Man, I really couldn't watch that Dark Crystal show that was on Netflix. It was... I love the movie Dark Crystal. But I watched like three episodes of the show. I just could not get into it. It's like... It, 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 like I'm, I, in my opinion, I thought it was like really boring. And there were so many characters that it was just hard. And so many of them look alike. All the puppets look alike. And it's just really hard to parse. Maybe I needed to power through it. But I was I was not the biggest fan. Anyway, that's my Dark Crystal Netflix show hot take. All right, I think that's enough uh, Tim Burton for us today. Um, it is kind of late at night. I think I think I'll wrap up here because it's a whole other section. Th 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 this is where we were before, but. Um, Hey, you know, if anyone wants to see more of, of Alice and her crazy misadventures, uh, let me know in the comments and I'll see if I, I can do more. I don't know. I think I think we, we can go for another turn in the Garden of Madness.